Hello, hello. How are you, my friends? Good evening, Miss. Good evening, good evening. Today we finish the course, listen. And then you are on vacation. Rose, you finish today and you are on vacation. Or you continue yes. on, on Monday? Mm -hmm. Um, No, I have a vacation. I think that in a week. A week? <clears throat> mm -hmm. Ah, okay, okay. What about the rest of you? You're gonna be on vacation next week. I'm asleep. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Honestly. No, okay. That's okay. Okay. We need to wrestle. So let me look for your attendance here. This is from nine to ten. Okay. Good night, Miss. Hello, hello, Miss. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Okay. Pretty nice. Thank you. Hey, listen, I can't imagine all of the form. No, 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 Ana María García de la Cruz. Present teacher. Very good. Andrea Alejandra Peña. No. Diana Mangali Boquín. Very good. Diana Saray Alférez. Diana, no Diana. Emma Débora. Ernesto José Arias. Eva Margarita Osorio. Present. Ok. Yo dudaba yo si era esta la lista o no. Gabriela Lisa Ramírez Alvarado. Gabriela. No Gabriela. Eh, Jessica Melanie. Joana Guadalupe. Joana. Eh, Lester Fernando. Present. Thank you, Lester. Melissa Giselle. No. Eh, no, Eduardo Amaya. Present teacher. Thank you, Noa. Eh, Nubia Daisy. Daisy. No. Raúl Alexander. Raúl. Present, Miss. Good evening. Okay, good evening. Present. Very good. Rosa Feliciana. Present. Thank you, Rose. Zaira Abigail. No, Zaira. Silvia Noemi Campos. Present, Miss. Thank you. Stephanie Carolina Javier. Present, teacher. Very good. Suani Marilaces. Present. Suani, nice to see you. Wilder Gabriel. Present teacher. Very good. William Alfredo. Present teacher. Excellent, my friends. Very good. So remember good that teacher. today. Hello, Jessica. Let's see, Jessica. <laughs> yeah, yeah, post absent, Jessica. No. I'm sorry, teacher. <laughs> no problem, no problem. Alguien que se ha incorporado hace, desde hace poquito. Let's see here in the chat. I have. Teacher, acabo de entrar. Andrea Peña, let me see. Andrea. Andrea says Andrea. Ajá. Uh -huh. uh -huh. Me he puesto ausente también. Andrea. 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 
Tuli sitä saa kotona vähän Okay. Eh, muy bien, me mandó un mensaje que ya se va a conectar en un momento. Ah, okay, okay, thank you. Yeah. Thank you. Now I'm going to share your names. Alex Belloso. Alex, ¿le escribo el nombre completo o, 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 o lo puede hacer usted? Me indica, please. Ya lo había, corre ya lo había corregido, mis. No sé por qué me aparece así siempre. Quizás se, se salió. Pasa a veces cuando se sale o no sé, la aplicación, no sé por qué se lo cambiará. Lo cambia, please. So, your complete name there, please. Okay. So, now let me see. I'm going to share with you. I want to share with you the, the manual. Mm -hmm. I had it here by like hand. Teacher. Hello, it's Nidia. Hello, Nubia. Nubia. Tengo, tengo una Nubia. fuerte gripe, pero si no puedo ah, ir a la casa, me duele, pero quiero escuchar. Hi, thank you, Nubia, for your effort. Presente, We are going to mi última clase. Yes, of course, Nubia. Let's see. And this is listening. No, it's not listening. The changing family is not listening. I just want the listening of this activity. Just give me a second. This is here. So I'm going to share with you the manual. We are going to read together these, and then we are going to answer the question. And the reading is about the changing family. It says, read the title of the article, then check the question you think the article will answer. Why do women work outside the home? What okay? What happens when both parents work? Mm -hmm. Why do women work outside the home? And what happens when both parents work? So we're going to read this together. It says here. I'm going to read the first time and then you are going to read for the class. I'm going to read section by section. So the first one is here. It says, American families are changing. No, American families are changing. One important change is that most married women now work outside the home. What happens when both parents work? Read about the Morales family. Okay. A volunteer to read the first part. Rose, thank you. Start reading, please. American, American, families, American families are changing. One important change is that most married women um, no work outside uh, the home. What happens when both parents work? And uh, read about the Morales family. Okay, very good. Thank you, Rose. So the next part. Judy and Steve Morales have three children. Josh, 12, Ben, 9, and Emily, 6. Steve is a computer programmer. This year, Judy is working again as a hospital administrator. The family needs the money, and Judy likes her job. Everything is going well but there are also some problems. A volunteer to read the second part. Ana Maria, thank you. Go ahead, please. Mm -hmm. 
Yuri and Steven Morales have three children. Josh, 12 men, nine, and family, six. six. Steve is a computer programmer. programmer. This year, Judy is working again as a hospital administrator. The family needs the money and Judy likes her job. Everything is going well, but there are also some problems. Okay, very good, Ana Maria. Thank you. Thanks for your help. Now, the next part, let's see here. Okay, now that Judy is working, Steve has to help her more with the housework. He doesn't enjoy it, okay? A volunteer to read about Steve. No volunteer. The part is Steve. A volunteer. I teach it. Okay, go ahead, please. Now, uh, now that Joy is working, Stephen has to help her more by the housing work. He doesn't enjoy it. Enjoy it. He doesn't enjoy it, okay? So Steve he, has to help. He doesn't enjoy Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Uh -huh. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Very good. Thank you. Yes. It says, um, Steve has to help her more with the housework. Housework. Okay. Thank you. So the next one is, Judy loves her work, but she feels so tired and busy. She also worries about the children. Judy has to work on Saturday, so Steve and Judy don't have a lot of free time together. Now, a volunteer to read about Judy. Mm -hmm. A volunteer. Alex, thank you. Go ahead. Judy loves her work but she feels too tired and busy. She also worries about the children. Judy has to work on Saturday, so Steve and Judy don't have a lot of free time together. Very good, Alex, okay. So it says, but she feels too tired and busy. Okay, very good, thank you. Emily, Emily is having a great time in her after school program. When Judy comes to pick her up, she doesn't want to leave. Now, a volunteer to read about Emily. Me, teacher. Go ahead, please. Emily, really? Mm -hmm. Emily, Emily is having a great time in her after school program. When Judy comes to pick her up, her up she doesn't want to leave. Very good, thank you. So next one is, unfortunately, Ben's school doesn't have an after-school program. Right now, he's spending most afternoons in front of the TV. Okay, a volunteer to read about Ben's. Unfortunately, uh, the Ben's school doesn't have an after-school program programs right now. He's spending most uh, afternoon in front of TV. Okay, very good. Thank you. Thank you, Jessica, right? So <laughs> yes. the last part, it says, John is enjoying his new freedom after school. Josh, Josh is enjoying his new freedom after school. He's playing his music louder and is spending more time on the phone. He's also doing a few household chores. I volunteer to read about Josh. Me, teacher. Okay, thank you. Go ahead. Josh is enjoying 
he is new Freighton after school. He is playing his music louder and spending more time on the phone. He is also doing a few household chores. Sure. Household chores. Very good. Okay, thank you. Now, when you're in the group, you're going to answer the questions about the reading it says read the article then answer the questions write the names of the family members okay it says for example number one which children are benefiting from duty working you're gonna write here the name okay so this is on the page number 35 go to your book page 35 and we are going to Work on that page in your in your book. And the other exercise is this one. Just give me a second. This is the other the next exercise. This one, this one. Let me see. Present continuous, right? Present continuous. That is the exercise number one. That's the reading. And the next one is this one. <clears throat> this is the next exercise. When you finish doing the reading, you're gonna continue doing this exercise also. Okay. It says, make questions in present continuous tense, then write the answers. For example, my cat is eating pizza. So what's the question? Is my cat eating pizza? Do you just change the order? Yes, it is. Yes, it refers to the cat. Your sister is watching the play. So here is your sister watching the play. That's a question, right? Yes. She yes, she very good. Yes, she is. And you continue the same way with the four questions. And, uh, ay, my goodness. Empecé de abajo. Okay. It says that you have to work with the present continuous, right? So, for example, here we are going to add ing. Play, playing, sit, sitting, get, getting. You are going to write it uh, in the correct way in the number two you're gonna choose the correct form of the verb to be here you have the sentences and you select the verb to be that goes according to the to the sentence here you're going to make positive statement with the present continuous and here the negative here you are an example okay and so you're going to do two things, the reading and this exercise. I'm going to share with you here the link. Okay, there you are the link. And we are going to, I'm going to organize the groups. Okay, let's get into the group and start completing the exercise. Everybody, get into the room and start completing the exercise. Jessica?
Teacher, no, no me sale para unirme a lo que... A ver, Eva. Ah, mándela conmigo, Eva. <ríe> you are, Jessica, you are in the number... I'm the number six. Yes. yes. So I'm going to send Eva to the number six. Okay. Uh -huh. No, no me sale. Es que, es que me uní en el teléfono, por eso no sé. Mm. Vuelvo sí, a, porque... a poner. Veamos, mis. Es que ya está en el seis, pero no sé por qué no le aparece. La voy a mover para un lado y después la regreso al 6. Mi pantalla. Bueno. Ok. Dice, eh, en el este vamos a ponerle el ING, ¿verdad? El, el... Así es. Agregar ING a los verbos. What, watching. Sería playing, ¿verdad? Y me... Playing. Corrí, playing. Si Correcto. Playing. Sitting. Driving. Driving. Dancing. Dancing. Giving. Doing. Sí, verdad, no hay ninguno mal escrito. No. Yo, yo creo que no, no estamos sí, bien. Thinking, driving, running. Ok. Vaya, sección 2. Aquí tenemos que poner el, el to be, ¿verdad? Aquí sería I am. I am. You are. You are. Are. Is. Are. Are. Is. Yes. ¿Verdad? Sí, yes, yes. I am, you are, Jay and her dogs are, my mm -hmm. brother is, my partner and I are, the two girls are, Jesse is. This, um, presente continuo. My dog ¿Qué is sería? Nice. I am... Having fun at the circle. Yes. He is here. He is giving. Giving. They are practicing. Practicing. My uncle is dancing. Mm -hmm. My uncle. Yeah. Ahí vamos, ¿verdad? Estamos bien. Yes. Sí. Bueno. Yes. Ay, aquí sería sí. en, en negativo. Ah, en la forma negativa. Dice, my grandma is in cooking in the kitchen. You are in making. You are in making. Sería. Está ahí, ¿verdad? Sería Aren making a very tasty cake. 
Yes. Okay. Um, Allen is Ethan. not. It's not taking. Taking. Picture. Jim is a. Ethan Cooling. Cooling. Don, Anna, 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 Uh -huh. Sister is washing the plane. Is, is your sister? Is your sister washing the plane? Washing the plane. Mm -hmm. The plane. Yes. Yes. He is. This are are, are you your yeah. friend? Are uh -huh. Are your friends going to the circus? Going to the circus. Are you friends? Friends. Going to. Going to. The circus. Are you. Are you friends? No. No, we are. Uh -huh. No, we are. No, we. No, they are. Mm -hmm. They, yeah, verdad. No, they are. Mm -hmm. No, they no, are, correct. No, they are. It's, uh, are they. Are they making. making uh yes. concert yes yes she are i know they are hey. yes they are yes they are excellent y en la la dos así es verdad porque está hablando de los amigos de él Uh -huh. Los amigos, o sea, ellos. Y aquí igual están ellos. Ok. Entonces acá es her cousin. Ajá. Uh -huh. Is her cousin playing in the in the circus. In the circus. No. He that he's pero sería aquí si es negativo es he's not verdad sí he's not oh, yeah. ¿Cómo? ahí estamos igual aquí creo que nos falta sí porque es negativa
Miss tiene el micrófono apagado. <laughs> thank you, thank you. <laughs> okay, thank you. Now let's see. The attendance list is this one. So I have here Abigail Elizabeth. Abby. Diana Saray. Present Emma. teacher. Okay, thank you. Emma. Present Miss. Very good. Ernesto. All right. And Gabriela Lisset. Gabriela. No. Mm, Joana Guadalupe. Present Miss. Thank you, Joana. And Melissa Giselle. Present. Okay. Thank you, Giselle. And Nubia Dicey. Present teacher. Okay, Nubia. Dicey is. Sí, Dicey. Mm -hmm. Es que hay unos que son Daisy, ¿verdad? Algunas personas sí. escriben Daisy. But you are Dicey. Okay. Dicey. <laughs> yes. Zaira Vigay. Zaira. No. Okay, so the next exercise we are going to watch. Mm, let me see a video. This is a uh, pregunta. Uh -huh. Fíjese de que, bueno, lo, o sea, no, no, creo que todos nos mandaron un mensaje para, como, para volvernos a inscribir al segundo módulo, pero. Si le soy sincero, a mí se me olvidó reenviar lo de que es el do y el need así escaneado. Entonces, no sé si ya, ya ahorita ya no lo puedo mandar o no sé. ¿Y a dónde lo tenía que enviar? Al correo de ellos, porque se, se, solo tenía que volver a llenar la solicitud en línea y mandar el do y el need así escaneado. Solo eso, pero la, la solicitud en línea sí la llené, solo el do uh -huh. y no mandé. Los documentos le hicieron falta. Ajá. Uh -huh. Ah, pues nomás termine la clase, mándelo. Vaya, está bien. Ajá, mándelo, indique pues que pues fue una cuestión de por tiempo, o qué sé yo, que no pudo, pero que quiere participar, pues quiere este seguir con su formación. Bueno, está bien, gracias, uh -huh. Y ahí ponga su número de teléfono si es posible cuando, cuando escribe el mensaje. Bueno, está bien, gracias. Okay, no, ¿eh? Sure. Okay, now Miss, let's see. Uh -huh. Dígame. Igual yo el formulario no lo he enviado, solo lo llené en línea y este no lo he enviado así como en, en PDF. Hoy no me ha quedado lugar, no sé si se puede mandar uh -huh. hoy en el transcurso de la noche o mañana. Mándelo, mándelo. ¿Para cuándo está el inicio de clase suyo? De ustedes, más bien. No, no nos han dicho cuándo. Los, los ah, pero es que es eso. Si usted no manda completo, la respuesta de cuándo se va a abrir el grupo tarda más. Así que traten de mandarlo hoy. ¿Todos tienen la disposición de seguir? Sí. Ah, bye. Entonces, tratenlo de mandar hoy mismo en la noche. Porque así usted garantiza que su grupo se abra pronto, pues. Yo lo mandé hace tres semanas. Va. Entonces, si nomás se lo piden, trate de hacerlo porque luego eso pasa. Uno se le olvida o, o se pone ya en otras cosas, como tanto que hacer, pueda que se les pase. Es mejor que garanticen ustedes mismos su, su, su cupo. Igual el compañero que dice del Duy del NIT tiene que mandar el, el manual escrito a mano en PDF. No solo el Duy del NIT. Ah, el comprobante. No, el comprobante después lo mandan ellos. Es un manual que se llena. Ajá, es, que, es, que yo, es que yo solo lo llené en línea nada más, pero no lo he enviado así. El que manda, que tú lo tienes que imprimirlo y mandar en PDF. Exacto. No solo es el do y el need, sino que también es este, eso que se llena en línea. Se tiene ah, que. Sí. Ir, solo, solo es en online nada más. Uh -huh. Sí, pues sea a mano o en línea. Entonces entiendo que Rosa indica que, que tienen que mandarlo, ¿verdad, Rosa? Siempre, siempre, por ejemplo, en mi caso, yo lo he hecho en línea y siempre me mandan. 
un link para que yo lo pueda descargar, imprimirlo, llenarlo y volver y volver a enviar en formato Esto PDF, bien. incluido con el doyel. Escanea todo ese documento. Ya no sé si lo logran ver, es que tengo ya en las manos. Alex, uh -huh. ¿se es... imprimió? Sí, hoy lo imprimí, que se me había olvidado. Uy, pero ya lo tiene completo. Y es esto. Sí, todo, llenarlo me hace falta y mandar. Uh -huh. Yo lo que hice, yo eh, reenvío siempre el, el primero que llené, no lo estoy imprimiendo cada vez, ¿verdad? Porque es el mismo. Solo que no le puse qué curso es. Creo que no lo piden ahí, en el, en el escrito no lo piden. Entonces yo ese mismo PDF envío, ya lo tengo ahí guardado. Y ese enviado desde que empecé. Uh -huh. Ok, okay. Rob. Okay. Como las pilas, lo que no lo hemos mandado ahora. Se va a tener que pelar. <risa> <risa> no, pero esto lo llena rapidito. Sí, porque yo, yo ya envié los dos documentos que dicen nada más, el online y el DUI nada más. No piden llenar el formulario, el que tiene el compañero ahí. Mm -hmm. Ya siempre lo piden, teacher. Bueno, no siempre, sé, pero a mí me lo han pedido. Lo sí, en mi caso siempre lo han pedido. Sí, ah, el, no manual, lo pide. el manual. Vamos Ajá, a ver. El... Si me esperan un ratito en línea, aquí voy a preguntar. Okay. Pregunto que si siempre hay que, que, que es lo que hay que mandar para que inscribirse, para inscribirse uh -huh. al siguiente móvil. Es que, que cuando uno ya ha llenado en línea el, ese manual. De, de una vez le mandan un correo a uno. Ya te inscribiste eh, online, ahora descarga ah, y escribes en PDF y envíalo con, con los otros documentos, que sería Duinip, ¿verdad? Uh -huh, pero, hay que, uh -huh. pero hay que hacer el PDF y enviarlo uh -huh, por correo. Uh -huh. Ok. Ok, entonces eh, ya, 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 ya sabemos cómo es. Uy, yo estoy compartiendo. No, Diana. Sí, usted. No. Así. Ah, Diana. Diana. Es que ah, okay. quería enseñarle al compañero de Enseñarlo, pues, enséñelo. No es problema. Pues sí, para que se orienten y, y hagamos las cosas a tiempo. Vaya, aquí en el correo, aquí está, mire, se va a un, un ciber usted, llena el formulario con sus datos, su nombre, su y y todo en, en algún la, en color lapicero que se vea, ¿verdad? Creo que la sigo del mundo. Y por último, lo que ellos me dijeron que era bastante importante era la firma de uno. Aquí está. En la firma con la fecha en que uno se, se inscribió y el DUI está en uh -huh. Y luego, este fue el primer documento que me pidieron. Y si era, me dijeron que era bastante importante que es el formulario que el compañero tiene impreso y luego iba el comprobante del manual que usted lo va a ir a escanear que lo imprima lo llena con su nombre completo número de y y su firma y lo envía al ciber le puedes ir al muchacho que esté en el ciber pide que mándeme los dos los documentos que de ese whatsapp y usted ya solo lo, lo envía por al correo punta. ajá al punta aquí el correo de ellos aquí me aparece el encargado creo que es el nuevo ¿no? ¿Quién es el que contesta a veces en el grupo de dónde estamos todos? Y aquí me puso que ya lo recibió, recibí. Así va a ser, compañero. Usted redacta aquí, copia el correo del, del coordinador, creo que. Y ya le coloca ahí alguna dedicatoria que usted le quiera poner. Que es el comprobante, le puede poner el, el manual y una disculpa porque es día tarde, ¿verdad? Y las razones. Así es como lo dice Ah, ok. Thank you. Uh -huh. Ok, Diana, thank you. Ya nos oriento, Diana, ahí cómo podemos hacer. Yo veo que ahí en el, en el, en el grupo les ponen como recordatorio, les recuerdan, acuérdense de inscribir, acuérdense de completar plataforma, acuérdense. Entonces es de tomar sí. acción cuando le manden el recordatorio. Ok. Sí, para que pues sí continúen con la formación continua. Pero están a tiempo. Yo diría que están a tiempo. Así que pila ahí. Ok, my friends. Mm -hmm. So the next exercise. This is. Uh, this is the spelling. Oh, creo que no lo compartí. 
this is the spelling. Uh, do you see about the present continuous? This is the spelling. Let me see. Let me... Yes, it is this one. So please uh, pay attention here because this is the spelling above the I. With the present continuous tense, you need to add ing to a verb, but it's not always that easy. Today I'll give you five simple rules for adding ing to a verb. Number one, does it end with w, x, or y? Snow, paw, grow, mix, fix, box, cry, fly, reply. All of these verbs end with w, x, or y. So we just add ing. No changes. Snowing, mixing, crying. Number two. Does it end with I and E together? Change the I, E to Y and then add I, N, G. With words like lie, tie, die, and vie. Let's change the I, E to Y and add I, N, G. Lying, tying, like this. Number three. Does it end with just one E? Make, dance, ride, save. All of these words end with one E. We're going to take off the E and then add ing. Making, dancing, riding, saving. And remember, it's just one E. Words like see and flee have two, so that's different. Number four. Does it end with a CVC word? A CVC word is a V, is a vowel in the middle. A, E, I, O, or U. We're going to double the last letter, then add ing. Shopping. H O P is a C V C word, so we double the P. Begin. G I N is a C V C word, so we double the N. And it's the same for get and swim. The C V C word doubles the last letter, and then you can add ing. Number five, the last rule is about stress. Stress is when we say part of a word stronger than the rest. Like elephant. The first L part is stronger. Or table. We don't say table, so the stress is on te, table. If the last syllable of the verb has no stress, then just add ing. All of these words end with a CVC word, but there is no stress on the CVC word, so we just add ing. We do not double the letter when there's no stress on the CVC word. And last, if the verb does not fit into these five rules, then just add ing. Words like eat, drink, do. They do not follow any of these five rules, so we just add ing. Any questions?
It's your turn to check out the homework. And good luck, everyone. Thanks. Now, based on those explanations, we are going to complete the following exercise together. This exercise, let me see, it's this one. Here, it starts to rain. Number three. What are they doing? They are watching tennis. They are watching a soccer team. They are playing soccer. They are playing soccer again. Okay, let's see. They are watching a soccer game. Number four. What is he doing? He's playing the drums. He's playing the guitar. He's doing the drums. He's doing the drums. He's playing the drums. He's playing the drums. What is she doing? She's reading the elephant. She's reading the elephant. She's reading an elephant. She's reading an elephant. What are they doing? They are talking on the phone. They are saying on the phone. They are studying English. They are talking on the phone. They are talking on the phone. Okay, there we go. <laughs> Number seven. What is he doing? He's playing the snow. He's skiing down a mountain. He's climbing a mountain. He's climbing a mountain. He's climbing down a mountain. He's climbing a mountain. 
I'm on. He's crying now. Number eight. What is she doing? She's playing the guitar. She's playing the guitar. I know the ukulele. He's playing the ukulele. They are ice skating. What is he doing? Is he cutting in there? Is he teaching the class? He is learning a language. He's teaching a class. He's teaching a class. Okay, very good. He's teaching a class. Okay, just a moment. Don't leave, just a moment. She is drinking. He is sleeping. They are fishing. fishing. He is reading. He is reading. Okay, my friends, so this was just a uh, review about the present continuous for future tense, okay? So, and my recommendation is that you can, you, um, you make some time. Mm. 
Muy bien. <laughs> sí, me quedó el video ahí hablando del sol. Ok. Yes, my recommendation is that you have a lot of information in this module. You have different uh, links, practice, listening, reading, writing, grammar. So make some time to practice during the day, okay? Mm -hmm. You have to practice a little, uh, at least three times a week or on weekends that before you start the next module, okay? And for me, it was a pleasure. And thanks for your help, for your support. And uh, I, I, hopefully you can continue with the next courses. So be practice, be, um, make some time to organize your next registration for the next module, okay? So thank you, my friends, and have a good night. You're welcome. Thank me for all. You're welcome, mister. Okay.